Hello, and welcome to LeanPub. In this video, we're going to talk you through setting up a book on LeanPub using our Bring Your Own Book writing mode. This writing mode is intended for people who already have their own favorite tools for writing and formatting their ebooks, and for people who have already completed their manuscripts and don't need to use LeanPub's in progress writing workflow. When you're done watching this short video, you'll know how to create a new book on LeanPub, where to upload your book files, and how to set everything up for selling your book through our online bookstore, where you'll make an 80% royalty on every sale. To get started, click the blue button to create a new book. We make it really easy to set up a new book, and later on it's easy to change everything you do at this stage. On this page, you can give your book a title, select a web address for the book's public web page on LeanPub, and you can also select a language. Next, you'll see our various writing modes. In this video, we're going to use the Bring Your Own Book writing mode. Please note that with a standard or pro plan, you can actually switch back and forth between any of our writing modes at any time. Underneath the writing modes is where you can select a LeanPub plan. Check out the options to see which one works best for you. Right now, we're just going to go with the free plan. Next, we give you a form where you can enter your account information to create a new account if you're not already signed in to an existing LeanPub account. We recommend you pick a username that matches what you do on social media if you're active on Twitter, Facebook, or Instagram. All right, let's click the blue button and create this book. When you create a new book, we take you to a page with some helpful information for getting started. We recommend you give this page a good read at some point, but in this video, we're just going to dive in and click the link to go to where you upload your book. Click on Getting Started in the menu. To go to the upload page for your book files, click on Preview or Publish, and then Upload. Okay, now go to the folder on your computer where you keep your book files. Here's where we're keeping the files for this book. You can upload three ebook file types to LeanPub. PDF for reading on computers, EPUB for reading on phones and tablets, and Mobi for reading on a Kindle device or in the Kindle app. Please note you don't have to upload all three file types. You can upload just one or two file types if you only have those, and you can replace them or add more file types at any time. Please note that while LeanPub indicates that these files have been successfully uploaded, in the background we're actually doing a security check on them to make sure they don't contain any viruses. Until the process is complete, if you stay on this page, you may see a progress bar on the top. Once it's all done, you'll see download links here so you can download the file and double check that you've uploaded the correct file if you're into double checking things. While we're here, I'd like to take this opportunity to point out that LeanPub has great support channels for authors. If you scroll down to the footer, you'll see that we have an authors forum where you can join the LeanPub author community asking and answering questions. We also have a dedicated author help center. You can access all of these helpful resources and more from the footer on any LeanPub page. You may have noticed already that you can also upload sample book files if you have them. A sample book is typically one or two of the first chapters of your book. Potential readers can download this sample book on LeanPub to see if your book is right for them. We think of the sample book as being kind of like letting someone in a physical bookstore take your book down from the shelf and have a look inside. All right, now that we're done uploading our book files, let's go to the publish page for this book and click the button to get it up for sale on the LeanPub bookstore. After the publishing process completes, we'll show you what the landing page for a published LeanPub book looks like. Then we'll walk you through the process for adding some information about your book, adding information to your author profile, adding a cover image, and setting the prices for your book. Okay, now that the process is done, click at the top left here to see what your book landing page looks like. There's not much here yet because we haven't added any information, so let's start by adding a book cover. To go back to the LeanPub menu options for your book, click the blue edit button. Only one of the book's authors can see this button, so don't worry about anyone else seeing it. Clicking the edit button will take you to an overview page where you can see all the options for what you can do with your LeanPub book, including the page where you can upload your book cover. Let's go there. On this page, you'll see some helpful information you'll need to format the cover image for your book. Click the button to find the file on your computer and upload it. A note about covers, they're very important. If you're not going to pay a professional to make a cover for you, we recommend you select a nice looking cover image from something like unsplash.com like we did for this cover. Okay, now let's add some information about this book. First, we'll go to the book details page and add a subtitle to the book like a how-to guide. Next, in the menu, go to Book Web Page and select About the Book. Here you can add some teaser text. And you can also add some information about the book. Next, let's set the prices for this book. To do that, go to Store and then select Pricing. LeanPub uses a variable pricing model that lets you set a minimum price and a suggested price for your book, and then lets readers choose how much they want to pay. Let's raise our prices a bit above the default prices set for a new book. 
These prices are in US dollars and will be the same for all LeanPub customers around the world. You can change these prices anytime. Scroll down a bit and you'll see Maximum LeanPub Discount Percentage. Setting a percentage here means you are opting in to LeanPub, including your book, in our email newsletter sales and other promotions at our discretion. This is a great way to reach tens of thousands of email newsletter subscribers interested in LeanPub books, and we highly recommend everyone opts in every one of their books to this feature. Okay, let's scroll down and click the blue button to update the prices. Finally, let's add some information to our profile. To do that, click your avatar at the top right and then click Edit Profile. Here you can upload a picture of yourself. You can also add some information about yourself here. You can also embed a video if you like, and we recommend you add your social media usernames here. OK, click the blue button at the bottom of the page to update your settings. All right, now let's go back to the overview page for the book by going through the LeanPub menu. Click the cover image at the top left to see the changes to the landing page for your book. Here you'll see all the information we just updated, like the subtitle and the teaser and the about the book information. All right, that's it. With your book already up for sale and with a professional looking landing page, you can go out there and market your book and make 80% royalties on every sale you make through LeanPub. Finally, let me show you just one more thing before you go. I thought I'd take this opportunity to introduce you to our Front Matter podcast. On the Front Matter podcast, we interview LeanPub authors about their lives, their areas of expertise, their books, and at the end of each interview, we discuss the author's experience writing and publishing. It's a fun and interesting way to learn about everything from data science to founding startups, and of course, advice for being a successful self-published author. I absolutely love hosting the podcast, where each interview is deeply researched, so we can really get to know the author and their work. Thanks for watching.